Hey guys, so in today's video, I'll be showing you the format of the cover letter of my I-751 or the Petition Term of Conditions on Residence. And this is the format. This is actually just for your reference. And you can actually do whatever format you want in your cover letter, but mine looks like this one. Okay, in the upper left side of the cover letter is the address USCIS Attention dash Attention I dash seven five one PO Box two one two hundred Phoenix Arizona eight five zero three six dash one two zero zero. Um, we're using this address, guys. It's because we're we sent our packet at at the USPS, and it also depends on the location. So. Um, we're here in Colorado Springs so the right side of the letter is um, my husband and my name our address and the bottom is the date um, RE or regarding form I-751 petition term of conditions on residence for um, the name of the petitioner and then a number you can find this on your green card the number then dear USCIS officer I am filing form I-751 petition to remove conditions on residence with my spouse and the name of the petitioner and my wife entered the United States on a K-1 visa back in February of 2020 and we subsequently married she adjusted status to permanent resident in November 2020 we have remained married and living together. We respectfully request that this petition be accepted for removal of conditions and residence for the name of the petitioner. Second paragraph, we have enclosed signed form I-751, a USPS money order form $680. This includes biometric fee and a color copy of Melody's permanent resident card front and back. Please also find table of contents, copies of original documents, photos, and other supporting evidence, and three original notarized affidavits of support includes to verify the status of our marriage and ongoing relationship. Please note that we handwritten numbers in the upper right corner of the evidence that corresponds with the table of contents. Third paragraph, pursuant to Title 8 of Code of Federal Regulation, Section 216.4, Paragraph B1, and in consideration of the enclosed evidence, we respectfully request that the interview requirement be waived. I appreciate your prompt attention to this matter and respectfully request your favorable adjudication of this petition. Please do not hesitate to contact us with any questions or concerns. Thanks so much for your time. Sincerely, we put our signature, our names, we even include our contact number and in our, our email address. Then enclosed USPS money order, table of contents, signed form I-751, evidence for support. So that's it for today, guys. This is, so yeah, this is the... This is our cover letter and yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.